What's up my soldiers, this is Bob Leonard. Today I'm going to talk to you guys about talking to your recruiter. Now a lot of people would ask me this question, like when should I talk to a recruiter, when is the best time, when is the earliest time. There's no set in stone answer, you can talk to them at any time, but the only time that you can actually start doing things is pretty much at the end of your junior year. The best time to talk to a recruiter is probably the end of your junior year or like during the summer between your junior and senior year or sometime during your senior year. If you do it any sooner than that, then the recruiter can't really do much for you. They can't really recruit a 15-year-old or 14-year-old. They can like barely even talk to you about anything. A lot of people ask me like, well, hey, I'm a sophomore, hey, I'm a freshman in high school, should I talk to my recruiter now? The best thing you can do if you're a sophomore or if you're a freshman or something, you can call them up, you can email them, you can ask them questions about the Air Force to like kind of improve your familiarity with the Air Force. But you can't really sign up, you can't really like talk to them on a regular basis because there's nothing that they can really do for you. If you're still a freshman or a sophomore in high school, but you still want to talk to a recruiter, that's fine. You can still call them up, but they're not really going to be able to do anything with you. They can only answer a few simple questions. They can't sign you up. They can't get you in the delayed entry program. There's nothing that they can do for MEPS or ASVAP, really. Even your ASVAP score, that only lasts for two years. So if you take it in your sophomore year, it's only going to last two years. And then by the time you're ready to enlist, it's already expired. So the best time to ask, the best time to walk into a recruiter's office and say, hey, I want to join, sign me up, get me ready, so let's start the paperwork. The earliest time you can do that is at the very end of your junior year, the beginning of your senior year. And you want to do it sometime during the fall, sometime during the winter. During the summer, that's when a big wave of seniors just graduated high school and they're sitting around their mom's house and they're trying to join the Air Force. That's when the most amount of people come through the recruiting office and that's the least amount of time that your recruiter is going to have to deal with you. So. The best time is definitely during the fall season, probably like once you're like breaking into your senior year or maybe like at the very end of your junior year before the summer starts. That's probably the best time for availability for your recruiter and that's probably the best time you're going to get good answers out of them. <laughs> Something that I should note, if you're still in high school and you're only like 17, 16 years old, then you're not really going to be able to talk to your recruiter that often. The reason being is because you're still a minor and you're still dependent with your parents. So what your parent is going to have to do, one or both of them, if you have two parents, are going to have to come into the recruiting office and they're going to have to sign a piece of paper. This piece of paper is basically an agreement that says your parents know that you're trying to join the Air Force or trying to join the military and that they're okay with it and that you're okay to be able to talk to a recruiter. Otherwise, your recruiter really can't do anything with you. It also validates like your signature and stuff so that way you can sign off on stuff without your parents having to be present or your parents having to vouch for you or co-sign for you, whatever. So it really helps a lot. It really helps the process move a lot more smoothly and it actually gets things moving to begin with. Other than that, I mean, it's pretty simple. I had a lot of people asking this question, so that's why I'm making a video. That's pretty much it. So if you guys have any questions, leave them down in the comment box below. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace.